Good day and welcome to this week's episode of the MedicCast TV weekly commentary here at MedicCast.tv. I'm your host, Jamie Davis, the pod medic, and this week I have another brand new episode for you. On the episode this week, we're going to be talking about something that I kind of came up with and thought I would chat with you about the proper approach to how you deal with your regular con ed or refresher training. Why did I get this idea? Well, I recently went through my biannual research for National Registry. In this cycle, there is the update from EMTP to paramedics. So there was some new material, but the bulk of it was material like, you know, already new. Now I air quote that because I'm sure you're not surprised that every time you research, you have tons of stuff that you find out that you forgot you knew. Now, I know if you're thinking about, you've been through this a number of times, just like I have, and you've had things like ACLS, PALS, PEP, GEMS, PHTLS, and all the so-called alphabet soup classes. But even in those classes, I always come away with something concrete that improves my patient care in some way. So when I hear guys complain about their research or people in class that don't take it as seriously as I think they should, I get kind of annoyed. We are medical professionals, folks, and the professional part of that means that we have two things that we need to do. Number one, we need to maintain our knowledge and our skills. And two, we need to ask for help when we don't know what to do with a patient. Now, I'll deal with the second point in a future episode, but for this one, I want you to think about how you approach your training and education programs. You need to walk in the door with a positive attitude. I know you're tired. I, I've heard it all before, and so have you. But sometimes you have to fool yourself to get excited about some of these classes. So here's my tip for you this week. If you find yourself not looking forward to your class, give yourself a challenge. Be honest and say to yourself out loud that you are going to find 10 things that you either didn't already know or forgot you knew about that class. Now, it's going to serve two purposes. It'll help you stay awake and alert, and that's good. But it'll also give you those little gems that you can relearn, re-remember, and take back with you into the field. And that'll make your patient care better. So adopt the right attitude in your classes and training sessions and put the work in to be a healthcare professional and improve your patient care and patient outcomes. I'm Jamie Davis, the pod medic. That is this week's weekly commentary here at the MedicCast. Stay tuned here for more up at, coming up at MedicCast.tv for all of the weekly commentary segments, as well as the regular MedicCast episode studio videos. And don't forget to thank our generous sponsors. And of course, as always, please remember, scene safety, BSI.